Do you consume alcohol? I do not. I gave up drinking when I was 19. Whoa, that's a long time ago. Was there an incident? Was there an incident that led you to that conclusion? Yes. I arrived when I moved to Hawaii, I arrived in the summertime. And the waves were very small. And then all of a sudden we were in winter. And my good friend, Bobby Cloutier, we were going to college together. So he came running and he said, the surf's up, Felipe, let's go. So we put the boards in the car and we drove down to Sunset Beach. On the way to Sunset, he stopped by the roadside and picked up a Hawaiian who it turns out his name was Kealoha Kaio. And at that time, he was one of the great Hawaiian big wave surfers. So we arrived at Sunset Beach, Bobby Cloutier, Kealoha, and myself. And the surf is huge and totally messed up. I mean, it is stormy, horrible, huge day. And Bobby turns to us and he says, let's go out for exercise. So I asked, go out where? And he said, right here, right here, sunset. And so I said, you're crazy. You know, if you go out there, you're going to die. I'm not going out there. So anyway, him and Kealoha went out and I stayed on the beach. And I was sure I'll never see him again. But wow. they did survive. They came back in. And I probably had an hour or an hour and a half by myself on the beach to think about it. And my thoughts started out by saying, you know, I'm 19 years old. Why should I die? And uh, I seriously considered giving up surfing. But then I thought if I give it up, I may in the future feel that I did the wrong thing. Mm. So instead, I decided to give it my best shot for 12 months. And I also decided I was going to get into the best health and the greatest fitness I could because I told myself, if you drown, it's much better to drown with the idea that you did everything that you could and you drowned, which is much better than thinking if I hadn't been drinking and up, up until late last night, I wouldn't be drowning. So anyway, I gave it up at that age. And a year later, I loved big wave riding. And so, you know, I stayed in Hawaii and st stuck with it. But I never found a good reason to drink since I had already been without it for a year. And, and I loved my life and everything was good. Wow, that's fascinating. That's a, that's a lot. That's a very mature, um, long-sighted decision to make for a 19 year old kid that's true but uh you know it was a serious decision and it sounded much better than going out there and drowning <laughs> yeah 100 percent. a lot of kids though wouldn't connect drowning to having had a long night out before you know or they might not they just would think that it'd be worth uh, risking that, never thinking that they would actually drown. Well, that's because they weren't sitting on the beach looking at what yeah. I was looking. 